Everyone, thanks for tuning in. I'm going to talk about my next career steps. So what I'm going to do with my career, uh, I've, it's a pretty big transition for me. So this is kind of more of a personal video, but hope you uh, stick around to hear it out. So and before I begin, I want to give a shout out to Ledin. They're one of my sponsors. Ledin is the best place to get a crypto mortgage or borrow against your crypto using it as collateral. Be aware this is going on margin. You could get margin called. So make sure you read up on this. Either check out my own videos on the topic or um, go check it out uh, with a few Google searches. So, OK, let's go ahead and jump on in. I'm leaving Kraken. So uh, not leaving, leaving Kraken, but I've stepped down from my director of growth marketing role. Um, now, I couldn't be more bullish about the company Jesse Powell has built. Jesse is the CEO. I worked with some incredibly talented people. They are an amazing shop. Really love everyone that I worked with. And it's, 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 it's a bittersweet thing. But I've been there three years. And in crypto years, that's a super long time. <laughs> that's a very, very long time to be somewhere. Um, it's not the end of our relationship, though. I'll still be a brand ambassador where I can both elevate Kraken's brand and Bitcoin at the same time, which is really cool. As part of the same announcement, too, I'm really excited to say that I'm starting to work with Trust Machines. Trust Machines is looking to be this DApp platform developer to build Bitcoin decentralized applications. This is super cool. If you've seen some of my other videos on the topic, you know I'm really passionate about it. I think Bitcoin DeFi is going to be the next big thing in the bull run. So this is my chance to go work on that. The team is founded by Munib Ali, really sharp guy, formerly created Stacks. You might have read some of my stuff on that. So I'm going to be helping them with their marketing efforts. Really excited to be their marketing partner to go help it and build out their marketing team. So this is really, really fun. Um, the other team members, too, you've got like JP Singh, the other co-founder. You've got Aubrey Strobel on comms. Um, you've also got Rina Shah. She used to be at Binance US. She's leading operations. And then Asif Hariji. He used to be president over at Coinbase. So tons of really sharp people over there. Really fun. There's a link below to the website. There's not a lot there right now. <laughs> We're still hiring people. So if you're looking for a job too, ch check out our careers page. Um, but yeah, this will be a part-time thing for me. This is not full-time. So after leaving Kraken, um, I kind of want to try my hand at a couple different things. You know, It's been a long-term three-year sort of thing. So I need to go check out and see what else is out there. But Trust Machines is where I'm going to be spending a good chunk of my time. And uh, well, why Bitcoin define why now? So for some of you who may not have seen my other videos, this is my kind of quick TLDR on why DeFi is going to be a thing. Bitcoin is a pristine piece of collateral with the most credible monetary policy on earth. Building trust minimized applications is, cr is critical for Bitcoin to absorb further mindshare and use cases in this space. So what is DeFi? Well, if you ask people what DeFi is, you'll get a, do a dozen different answers. DeFi to me represents smart contracts to unlock some sort of financial tool or primitive. This can be as simple as lightning or it can be something more complex like stacks or DLCs. And I know a lot of Bitcoiners are skeptical, rightfully so. There have been many false promises, scams, fraud, etc. But just because there have been many mistakes and failures and scams doesn't invalidate the entire sector. And after all, Bitcoin was the origin of many DeFi applications like NFTs, first launched on Counterparty with Rua Pepe's. Yield, join, join market, you can earn a yield by tumbling your coins with others. This is the oldest app in existence. And DAOs, this was talked about in the Bitcoin talk forums. So there's a lot of uh, experimentation that was like really core to Bitcoin in the early days, and I'm excited to see that come back. And so here's some of the projects I find personally fascinating. I'm gonna go, do kind of a speed run through these. If you wanna check them out, uh, check out the article. The article is on the free version of my newsletter, so it's publicly available for everyone to go check out. Um, Lightning, so they created Lightning Pool. It's basically an order book for Lightning liquidity or a channel marketplace done in a non-custodial non manner. So that's really fun. You've got DLCs, so this is where two parties can bet on a certain outcome based on XYZ condition being met. For example, the price of Bitcoin might be X tomorrow. Companies working on it, Atomic Finance and Shared Bits. You need an oracle for this to pipe in external data. And then Atomic Finance is trying to do this by building options on Bitcoin. Stacks, it's a smart contract layer on top of Bitcoin with the ability to do smart contracts that work on Bitcoin and uh, stack simultaneously, which is really cool because the Stacks blockchain can read the Bitcoin blockchain. So companies working on it, Arcadico, Console, and Zest. Console and Zest are trust machines companies. Console is trying to disrupt. Um, uh, you've got Console, which is disrupting the, uh, so, so sorry, let me start with Zest first. So Zest is trying to disrupt the uh, lending and borrowing space. So it's a very similar product to Maple Finance, but on the Bitcoin blockchain. So essentially allows uh, big institutional counterparties parties to lend and borrow from each other. And there's a coordinating function with a, with a, a sort of like um, 
governance token where people can can measure their credit worthiness and, and state capital with their measurement of someone's credit worthiness. And uh, console is trying to disrupt Discord. So these are really cool products. RSK, this is a really old smart contract platform by a smart uh, sidechain. Sovereign is a cool company working on that. Um, like I said before, join market. So you, you can earn a yield by mixing your coins. Um, they're building a new GUI. So this new app called Jam. This GUI is being worked on by Jirgigi and Wakamo. These guys are awesome, really hardcore Bitcoiners, doing great work there. I think they're doing God's work. So you can check out the GitHub or Telegram. In conclusion, really excited about these next steps. I'm still team Kraken, still love Kraken. Um, but if you if you have any sort of marketing efforts that you're thinking about, I'm pretty much booked up. But if you want to shoot me an email, if you're curious, happy to give you some of my insights in terms of like pointing you in the right direction. And then if you're building something cool in the DeFi world, also let me know, either do it in the comments or on my website, you can find my email. All right, cheers, appreciate it. And uh, thanks everybody. All right, bye.